Hello and welcome. This is Kendra and I'm so glad you're here. I'm so excited to be designing for Pink and Main using their Crafty Courtyard subscription kits. And today I'm sharing an unboxing video of the May of 2023 kit called Pretty Posies. This is a monthly kit, so there's a limited number available. So subscribing to their monthly kits is the only way to guarantee that you'll receive one. I do have a link in the description box below if you're interested. So let's take a quick peek at the contents inside the box. Each of the Crafty Courtyard kits come in a bright pink box packaged neatly with tissue paper. It includes this mesh zippered project pouch, which I love to use to store my supplies in while I'm traveling. The newer kits now include a page that lists all of the kit contents along with the color palette. The bottom section includes the social media channels for Pink and Main and the hashtag to use if you want to post and share your creations. Also included on the back side of this page is uh, there's four different card sketches and this just gives you some ideas of what you can create with the kit. Now the monthly subscription base price is $34.99 and an automatic shipping charge is added based on your location. Now the kit includes six sheets of 100 pound 8.5 by 11 inch colored cardstock. In these colors, this red one here is called Stop Sign. The next one is called Construction. The yellow is called Street Light. And then the darker purple is called Night Sky. The lighter pink is called Salon. And then the darker pink is called Dress Shop. And then you'll also get two sheets of 110 pound heavyweight white ice rink cardstock. Normally the kits include an embossing folder, but this month I'm super excited that this kit includes the full size container of red embossing powder called Ro Rosy Posy. It's this deep, beautiful red that has a slightly metallic look to it. And it's a big container that will last a long time. It also includes the sequin mix and all of the beautiful, warm, cheerful colors of the kit. And they have a little bit of an embossing detail. And then there's also this pack of glitter enamel dots in three different sizes. And these embellishments coordinate well with the colors in the paper pad, which I'll show you here in just a minute. This is the exclusive 6x6 six six stamp set called Pretty Posies. And it's a combination of images and sentiments. It's got four different line drawn flowers and this whimsical frame, plus a flower pot, these solid stamps that let you quickly color your images. Now, the solid stamps don't line up exactly, but they were meant to be that way to give it a little bit of an abstract look. It also has these tiny butterflies and a dragonfly, plus the little dash swirly line that you can use with the butterflies. It has sentiments like just a note, thinking of you, happy days, hello there, and sending cheer. It also has these matching dies for each of the images, as well as a word and shadow die that says sweet friend. So this fun stamp and die set that also includes a sentiment die is well worth the value of the kit. But you get all of these other goodies as well. So it also includes this large stencil with all of the different shapes of flowers and it co coordinates with those flower stamps. So you can use this large stencil with pretty much any size card you'd like to create. And since it's a larger stencil, it fits in the pink and main storage binders. This is the 6x6 paper pad called Warm Basics and it contains 24 double-sided sheets. It's just like the Cool Basics paper pad that came out a few months ago, but it has all the same patterns, except these are in warm colors, the same colors that are in the kit. Now there are a few plaid patterns, this checkered pattern in all six colors, some diagonal stripes, this thin line crisscross pattern, not really sure what you want to call that, but that also comes in all six colors, another plaid, some horizontal stripes, and also some polka dots in all six colors. And then there's a pattern with bigger dots and more of the same patterns, but in the different colors. I love that these patterns are small enough for card making and the papers coordinate well with each other. There are two each of 12 designs and they are all non-directional, which means it doesn't matter which way you turn it for it to be upright. So you don't have to worry about um, figuring out which way you need to turn the paper when you're doing your cutting. And they work great for my quarterly card sketch challenges. Now, if you're not familiar with Kendra's card challenges, you can make 15 cards with six sheets of six by six pattern paper with little to no scraps. I hope you'll check it out and download the free printable with the cutting guides and card sketches. I'll place a link below to a video with all the details. 
I have already started creating cards with this fun kit, and I can't wait to share them with you. I'll give you a sneak peek here in just a bit. But here's a look again at all of the contents of the kit. It really is a great value, and you can make a bunch of cards. When you subscribe to the kits, it will be shipped around the 15th of the month, but you can still sign up and purchase it through the end of the month as long as it hasn't sold out. And if they have any kits left over after the month ends, they will be moved to the Pass Boxes and Extras page on the Pink and Main website. Now your subscription will change to the next month's box on the 1st. Now as mentioned before, if you'd like to purchase, I will have links to everything down in the description box. These are affiliate links, which means if you make a purchase, I earn a small commission at no extra cost to you. This helps to support my channel. So if you plan on doing some crafty shopping, I hope you'll consider using my links. Here are a few sneak peeks of the cards I'll be sharing in an upcoming video. I hope you'll click the thumbs up button to like this video and subscribe to my channel if you're not already a subscriber. Make sure you turn on the notifications so you don't miss any of my uploads. I hope you'll leave me a comment down below to let me know you stopped by. Thank you so much for watching and I hope you have a wonderful day. Happy crafting!